Look at the two biggest races you'll see on your ballot when early voting begins Tuesday. A new poll shows that Donald Trump leads Joe Biden in Texas. Trump with 50% of the vote, Biden with 45%, but the race remains within the margin of error. In the U.S. Senate race, incumbent John Cornyn has an eight-point lead over MJ Hagar. She, he is at 50%, she's at 42%. This survey done and released by the UT Politics Project and the Texas Tribune. So for perspective on this, let's turn to Ross Ramsey of the Texas Tribune, the co-founder and executive editor who commissioned the poll. Ross is in Austin. Ross, good morning to you. Good morning, Jason. How are you? Doing well. I, weren't a lot of surprises on those two numbers. Uh, what, what's your biggest takeaway from them? The gender gap on the presidential race is huge. Uh, Trump is winning with men by 16 points. Biden is winning with women by five points. If you go down to the next race, um, Cornyn's winning men by eight points and is winning women by four points. So, you know, women are really running away from the president in this thing. And I think that's one of the differences between the numbers in that race and the numbers in the Senate race. I wanted to ask you also about the uh, turnout because the top of the ticket, the top of the elections always usually drive turnout. But you think that the down ballot races might drive turnout uh, next month? I think so. I think, you know, some of these down ballot races are getting incredible amounts of money in them. National Democrats and Republicans are playing in state house races because redistricting is up next year. That money is presumably used in some ways to drive voters to the polls. I think both parties are trying to do it from the bottom up as well as from the top down. Yeah, clock is ticking as well. Ross, thanks. Back to you in a moment.